Hi, Uche, is that your name? Yeah, that's my name. Okay. Okay, so what did you want to tell me about what's going on with you, between you and Yolanda? Okay, um, I can't really remember the year because um, it's been a long time, you understand? So, but all I can say is um, everything she's saying on that, um, on the show, I know about, I'm, I know about everything, you understand? So, um, she, she lies so wait, a lot, you know, she, you're, she lied a lot. You're her boyfriend, right? You were her boyfriend, right? Yes, yes, yes. I have chats. <laughs> I have, I have chats with her, like, I mean, <laughs> I have proofs of everything. Did she stand. tell you that she was going on the show? Did you know she had another, did you know about this Williams guy? Okay, you know, um, before this whole thing started, she told me about um, trying to promote her, her the um, cooking stuff because on her page, she posts about food. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You understand? Yeah. So she said she was going to go into a show mm -hmm. and it's going to help her promote a, a cooking show. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. You understand? Yeah. That wow. she, she, wants to, she wants to do a, a show that's yeah. going to help her promote her cooking show and also it's going to give her, it's going to get, it's going to get her more fan base. Right, right, right. You, you understand? When she told you that, what did you say? What was your reaction? I mean, when, when your woman tells you something like that, you have to just support her. Okay, okay. You know, she didn't tell me about 90 Days Fiance. Oh. Like she, she didn't, yeah, she didn't tell me about, babe, I'm going for a, a, a show. It's called 90 Day Fiance. You understand? Uh, uh. So, <laughs> I mean, she, all she told me that she was going to do a show a cooking show. Oh wow! I, 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 I have I have the messages in my phone. Uh -huh. You understand? Yes. Because if she had told me that she was going for this ninety day fiance thing, uh -huh. I would have like okay, I would have asked her what's my own um role in it. Like right, how do right. I come into it? Yeah, yeah. You would have supported her, right? Of course, of course. Then I I won't I won't like um. Be, be um how has it called? I wouldn't be surprised when I see my name right. on the internet. So how did you find out? You you were just going on the internet? No, no, no. You know I'm on Instagram because I met Yolanda through Instagram. Right. Oh, oh okay, okay. Yes, we met through Instagram. Mm -hmm. So um on on this faithful day, I got a tag. Oh wow. By someone. Someone tagged you. Oh wow. Yeah, someone tagged me. Mm. I think that was when the show started airing on TV. Uh -huh. You understand? Oh, so you someone know? tagged me. Uh -huh. So someone tagged me, and the person said at Gucci Gucci Official because that's my Instagram <laughs> handle. The, the person said um, at Gucci Official, he's a scammer, and it popped up on my screen, and I'm like, what the fuck? How did this person know? How, how did this person? Know me to call me a scammer. Yeah. So I clicked. I clicked on um the tag, mm -hmm. and it took me direct to where the discussion of the whole Yolanda thing came up, came about, mm -hmm. and there I saw comments oh. of people, you know, saying I am the one who is catfishing her and all that, mm -hmm. and that was how I got to know about about this ninety day fiance thing. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry that happened to you. Were you mad? <laughs> Man, I, seriously, I won't lie to you. At the first, um, initially, I took it as one sort of, um, I mean, like I didn't need to put interest in it. You understand? Right, right. Like I, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't pay much attention into it. But again, I saw my name, like my my picture, oh my, my picture, my picture, my face, everything about me written on the internet. Like <laughs> if you Google my name, if you Google my name. On, on if you search for my name on Google, mm -hmm. if you write, if you click Uche Gucciano eBay, you're gonna see my name pop out, and you're gonna see where they say my name as in uh, my uh, underneath is a scammer. Mm. Wow! So that was when I didn't take the whole thing funny anymore. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah. Seriously.
Mm-hmm. So I went, I went to Yolanda and I asked, and I told her about it. I said, babe, what's going on? Mm-hmm. There's this news going about saying I'm a scammer. Oh, what's, they did not call you that. Did they say that? That you were a come up? Yes, they called me a scammer. Like, see, every, every fucking day I have these messages from white people. Oh, wow. And yeah, they're like, people can get real critical. They were just roasting you, saying all kind of stuff. They, and they'd be like, hey, you young man, go get a job and stop catfishing, and stop catfishing people. <laughs> I'm sorry that happened to you. Oh, my God. This and I'm is- like, and I'm like, hey, man, what you talking about? I have a job. Like, right now, I'm at work. Mm-hmm. This, is my office. this is my office. You understand? Mm-hmm. So everywhere, anyone who calls me on video call, I show, the peop- I show them my, where I work. I have a job. So why would they be saying I should go get a job and stop catfishing people? Oh. Doesn't make any sense. I don't do that. I don't do that shit. Like I don't do that scamming thing. I don't. I don't do it. Yeah. I hate it. So they be like, every morning I wake up, I see a message from a white person. So you what did you say to her? What did you say to Yolanda? I told her, see, there's, there's this rumor saying I'm going about on the internet saying I'm a scammer. Come mm. out and tell them I'm not a scammer. And she be like, and she and she says to me that I should not talk to anyone. I should just keep quiet. Mm. Wow. <laughs> Man, I'm, I'm, I'm African. You understand? I'm a Nigerian. Mm-hmm. And we know about this camp thing. You understand? And yeah. we know about, we know, I, 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 I definitely know how your president, you <laughs> know, is, yeah. is all up against us, we Nigerians, yeah. about this camp thing. Right. You understand? Right. Yeah. So she's saying I should keep quiet doesn't make any sense to me. Mm-hmm. Because my family got to know about it. Oh no, really? Yes, oh. and they were really upset. Oh, they different. were really ups- They were really upset about it. Oh, mm-hmm. yeah. Because because I have plans to come over to the states. Mm-hmm. You know, because my uncle is over there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So if I go to the embassy to apply for a visa, I'm sure you guys won't give it. I won't be given the visa. Oh, you know, you you might be right about that. Yeah. That, because oh, my name know. is because my name is already on the internet at this camera yeah so, so i tell her so, okay so she asked you to ignore it and yeah she, she, she told me to ignore all anyone who's gonna come to my dm to ask for questions to ask questions mm-hmm. she told me i should not pay any attention to any bloggers wow like i should just keep my mouth shut for crying out loud i mean i'm, I'm a man you don't tell me to keep quiet when I know something is wrong. <laughs> yeah. 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 Well, okay. so then you didn't do it. You you didn't keep quiet. What did you do? Um. Next? Okay. What I did next was um, a friend of mine. She's like a sister to me. So too. Mm-hmm. She was like because she has she, a, a fiance is over in the states. Okay. Okay. So I think he watches the show. Oh, wow. This is getting bad. Okay, go ahead. So she was the one that told me about this whole thing, like, Uche, your name is on the internet as a scammer. And I'm like, what are you talking about? Mm-hmm. Mm. That was even, initially, I got to know about the stuff um, through um, the tag. You understand? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But I, di- I, I didn't take that serious. You understand? I was like, oh, it's just a normal thing. You yeah, yeah, yeah. But, but when my friend sent me, told me about the... Um, um, the, the 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 internet thing that my name is on the internet. Don't worry. After after the after the show, I'm, after the video, I'm gonna send you um, okay. pictures. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna send you pictures of how I got to know that my name is on the internet as a scammer. Wow. So so it was it was through my friend that so she was the one that said Uchi, you need to speak out. Wait, who said that? Yolanda? No, no, my friend, my oh, friend. Okay. Oh, she told you. Yeah, she. Yeah. And did you take her advice? Of course I did. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I did. <laughs> because it was not getting any funny anymore. Seriously. It was not getting any, it was not it was not a funny thing at all, I would say to you. Yeah, I'm sorry. Because 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 my family were really upset that I got in, I got involved with with um with an American and the person wants to like, you know, do this kind of thing to me. Well, how long did you guys date? Um we didn't date for years. Four years? Well, no, we didn't date for years, but oh. we did it for months. 
okay we did it for, for for months okay you understand but but throughout that month it was a sweet one did you love her of course i did you she told me she had three kids but on the show no. oh. kids well why would she love, what why would she love? she thought you might okay. leave if you said okay six. She told me she had three kids. Wow. But on the show, I'm seeing six kids. Yeah. I know. I'm sorry. I'm laughing out of, I can't believe the story. So I'm, I don't mean to offend you. But yeah, wow. no, no, no. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. Now, the, William, the, 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 the Williams guy, mm -hmm. the, the Mitchell, whatever they call him. He goes by another name besides Williams? No, no. The, no I mean, the fitness guy, the fair guy. Yeah, yeah, Williams, the, the fitness trainer. Yeah, 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 the fitness trainer. She actually told me that that guy had come to to see her in the states twice. Uh, is that true? Is, or Cheryl, you know? I have the proof. I have pictures. Did you come see her? That the fitness guy yeah. had has had come to the states to see her twice. Wait, what? what? Really? Then, oh, then, <laughs> then the show, the, then the show pops up, and I'm like, okay. Then the show pops up. Then she's telling me about being scanned and all that. I want her to be careful. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Be careful because I know we are, we are, I know my country. I know people who I, I know. I know how this scam thing works. You know. Mm -hmm. I know I know people uses um people's picture yeah. to scam yeah. people. Yeah, yeah. You understand? I, I want her. Be careful of those people. Now, she told me that she was um that Mavens, because if you go to the Instagram, you're gonna see that the, the, the whole story, you're gonna see that it's it's, it's Mavens underscore W M. You understand? Mm -hmm. So if on her page, because she's my woman, I always comment. I always like her pictures. Right, right. Yeah. But, but, but the food, but her um, transformation and all that, I always like everything. Mm -hmm. You understand? Yeah. So this Mavis guy saw that I was um, always liking her pictures and always commenting on her pictures. Okay. So the guy had to tell her to tell me to fuck off. <laughs> wait, wait, I'm sorry. Wait. <laughs> wait. Okay, did she do that? <laughs> so, so she told me that Mavens, Mavens is angry that I'm always commenting on her pictures, that I should stop it. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, who is Mavens? I'm supposed to be the only one you're dating. Are you dating right. someone else? Yeah. Then, then she shows me the picture of Mavens, who happens to be the fitness guy. Okay. And I'm like, wow. Why are you calling him Mavens instead of Williams? Because that's 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 his name. That's his name. That's that's, that's 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 a name. So they lied me. to us. His name is not Williams. It's Maven. <laughs> Man. Okay, you know what? What you might? Yeah, we we gotta talk about it. Go ahead. I want to. I want to ask you a question. Yeah. The fitness guy. Is he? Is he real? I mean, the fitness guy. He's real, but he's real. He said that he didn't know that his picture was being used on the internet. So he said that someone had just put, you know, catfished her. But he was real. No, no, no. Even when the stuff came up, I told Yolanda, my name is on the internet. Mm -hmm. Like I was always complaining to her. I was, going, I was always going to her on on a DM on Instagram mm -hmm. because that's where we communicate. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm like Yolanda. My name is on the internet. Would come on, come out and come out and clear my name. And she'd be like, I should shut the fuck up. That I, that her kids are not worried about. Uh, about uh, I'm not saying anything about this. That even the even Williams. So you you say everybody's in on the scam. The kids know. Yolanda knows. Of course, it's a, I think I think but it's a play. Know, like it's you know. it's all um it's a film stuff. They are they are filming that stuff because I have the pictures of where they're filming. Mm, oh my god! She, she, 
she always sent me pictures. So you're telling me that Yolanda scammed you. <laughs> she kept lying to you. Ne okay, okay, let me just let, let me just put it this way that she scammed me. Like she scammed me. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You understand? Yeah. She scammed me because she didn't want me to get involved in all this 90 day fiance thing. She even asked me if I know about the show and I told her no. Oh wow. She I don't really know about the show. Like, I don't know about 90 Day Fiance thing. I've never heard about it before. All I can say is I remember um Michael and Angela. Yeah, uh -huh. yes. Yes, because, but I didn't know it's called 90 Day Fiance. I did not know. Uh -huh. Because our own um, bloggers, you know, they put, they put this stuff, they put this up on their blog side. And I get a seat. Hmm. If you notice that Angela and Michael had a good relationship, did they have a good relationship? Yeah, yeah. You understand? So Michael went viral in my country. Oh, okay. okay. So Yolanda asked me if I know about 90 Day Fiance. I was like, and I'm like, I don't know about it. You understand? Mm -hmm. So I think she now used that means to go into what she went to. Oh, I mean, this this is heavy. You really you got lied to. <laughs> I mean, a, a whole lot. Were you were you hurt? Of course. Yeah. Do you, I'm so human. Did you end up breaking up with her? <laughs> okay, after the whole thing, after me, after um, me coming out to say the truth that I'm not a scammer, mm -hmm. that I'm not Williams, I'm not um whosoever is trying to scam her. Mm -hmm. Then, I think her fans or whosoever went to tell her. Mm. Even right before I was going to go live on Instagram with an American blogger, she said, I don't know who, I don't know if she's the one, I'm, but I got an, but I, I got an email. I know who you're talking about, the blogger. We won't say her name, but yeah. Okay. Okay. I, I got, a, I got an, um, I got an email from, I don't know if it's Yolanda or who, and the person's like, Uche, what's going on? I heard you going live. What you gonna do there? Oh. You understand? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right before I went on live, you understand? Oh. So, so um, you if you're saying I, I was hurt, or if she blocked me, or if we broke up, if you if we broke up, right? Um, then she posted on a page saying I'm gullible. Oh, sh what did she post on her page? Say it again. She posted that you're gonna about to go live. Yeah, that's that I'm gullible. That's what she oh, called no, me. That I'm, I'm gullible. You're gullible. That, like, as that, in that, that, yeah, that no one should listen to me. That I'm saying I'm all I'm saying is all I'm saying are lies. Uh, oh no, really? She, she 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 actually tagged my handle on her Instagram page. She has blocked me off her Instagram page. We don't communicate anymore. Oh. And I'm okay by it. I'm fine. <laughs> I'm not so bad to you. I mean, she was lying to you the whole time and kind of just toying with your emotions. And at the end of the yeah. day, she had, she wanted publicity, basically. She just yeah. wanted yeah. yeah, 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 yes. I actually know how much they're going to pay her for every episode she shoots. Don't say it. I know how much they get paid. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Don't, don't say it. Um, it's, I think the audience kind of knew something wasn't right with Yolanda. They kind of felt that she lied because she wanted us to believe such an outrageous story. <laughs> it, it, it just didn't make any sense. Yolanda but, and I had done, we have, we have seen each other like video calls before on Instagram. Mm -hmm. She sent me voice notes. I've also sent her voice notes. Mm -hmm. So okay. right now you, you, you're listening to my voice. Does my voice sounds like the person who called her on the show when no. she picked up the call? So, come on. But the thing that is shocking me is that we all, when Williams came forward, he said he knew nothing about it. Do you think he was in on it for money too? Well, according to what she told me when I went to her, she said Williams is not even saying anything. Oh, Williams wow. is not Williams is not speaking out that I should shut the fuck up and stop behaving like a kid. I'm sorry. I, mean, I can't believe that happened. Wow. That's what she said to me. Yeah. That even our kids are on the show. 
people are coming for them, but they're not saying anything about it. That's what she told me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the public kind of knew something was wrong. Did eventually did she tell you she had six kids, or you just seen that on the show too? What's it? Did she ever tell you that she had six kids, or you just saw that on the show? Cheryl, she told me she had three kids. And never told you the truth? She never told me the truth. So, I have so, I have a lot of stuff to spill, but I don't want to spill it here. Okay. You understand? Yeah. I can always tell you like one-on-one, -on -one, mm -hmm. privately, you understand? Okay. But I'm forgiving her. Are you I don't, sure I don't you forget you're not upset anymore? Are you forgiven her? No, 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 I'm not upset anymore. But the only thing she can do for me is whenever the show comes or ends, you understand? Mm -hmm. what, what I'm asking for her is to um clear my name off. Oh, she's never gonna do that. You're just asking her to tell the truth. She's not gonna do that. <laughs> I know. I, I I I know she's not gonna do that. I know she's not gonna do that. <laughs> I know she's not. Gonna, <laughs> I know she's not gonna do that. But <laughs> it's more. Yeah. But yeah, yeah, I did. I, I've done that. I don't. Yeah. I've done that. I think you're doing the right thing by coming forward because she's never gonna clear your name, and you don't want people to think of you as a scammer or you know. So, no, I'm not a scammer. Yeah. No, no, no. I have a job. Yeah. Well, that's a hell of a story. I mean, I'm sorry that that happened to you. And no, no like problem. Said, I think everybody in the in America kind of knew she was lying <laughs> because the things that she said just didn't make sense. But she did also would post on her Instagram the food and talk about the books and stuff like that and. I mean, I don't think it paid off. I don't think, well, she got paid. Maybe it did pay off. I don't know, but <laughs> you don't play with people's emotions like that. Sorry. You don't do that. that. You don't do that. Do that. Mm -mm. And I'm very, very emotional. Oh. Like, like when I found out I, I, I was caught as camera, I mean, I, I hate being accused of what I, I'm, I'm not doing. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. It doesn't make any sense. Yeah. Yeah. If I if I was a scammer, I wouldn't come up to you. Like I wouldn't be on this video call with you. You understand? Right. Exactly. Yeah. I won't. I won't. I won't go to um Katrina. Mm -hmm. You understand? So, yeah. come on. You don't. You don't joke with people's emotions. Yeah. All in the name of getting fame and all that shit. That's crazy. Listen, I have a co-host. Can I bring him in so he could get in on the conversation? Sure. Okay. Hi, Perry. Hey there. Good morning. Happy Do you Mother's feel Day. Bad for him? Huh? Do you feel bad for him? Yeah, I'm just trying to figure this out, right? Um, when did you and uh, Yolanda start dating? About six, seven months ago? Or would you say before that? You start talking. Okay. Okay. Um, I can't really remember the moment, except I try to go back to my Instagram um, message. Then I'm gonna see where the message starts from. But I think it's around May last year or something. But I seriously I can't remember. Seriously, I won't lie to you because I don't want to say anything for no. here. Yeah, no, we get it. You, yeah. you get. Okay, no, I got you. Get. you. So did this change your opinion, Perry, of uh, Yolanda? Huh? Did, did what he said change your opinion of Yolanda? Yeah, I'm just trying to just figure out what's going on. Like, I mean, because if he he pretty much started talking to her. You know, online and whatnot before mm -hmm. the 90 day started. Mm -hmm. So when she went to the 90 day, did she ever? I mean, she just was she still in contact with you while she was doing the 90 day program? Yeah. And when the last time have you spoke to Yolanda? Did you okay. Remember? Okay. Okay. Fine. That's a good question. I like that, sir. Um, at, when she when she started filming the stuff. The 90 day um 90 day fiance team when she started filming she was not always communicating with me regularly as like before okay you understand uh -huh. she comes on and off and she be like and, and i asked her oh babe where have you been and she'd be like um she, she tells me she's filming 
Oh, for and she told you what kind of show it was. She said it was a, a cooking show. She, yes, cooking show. That's what she told me. <laughs> wow, is this that, I'm, that, so that, I'm sorry. She, she told me, she told me that the crew are coming to her house. Mm -hmm. The camera crew. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah, that's what she told me. I mean, Perry, so, did you ever feel sorry for Yolanda? Oh no, I didn't. Did you feel like she was lying? I don't think yeah, anybody. I mean, I just felt like uh, she knew Williams wasn't real. I mean, that's what I felt like. Mm -hmm. And um, I, I mean, pretty much I figured it was a scam pretty much somewhere up in there. But this is my question. You said that you think the guy, the, the, now this Williams guy, you know nothing about him, right? I don't know Williams. Right. I mean, but she told you, Yolanda, you said Yolanda told you that he came to the United States twice? Mavins, the person I know is Mavins. Okay. Mavins is the fitness guy. Oh. Yeah, you see what he's saying? He doesn't right, go right, by right. Williams. I got what sounds Mavins. Like name anyway, didn't that name sound Mav Mav Mavins is the fitness guy. Mm. Hmm. Wow. Well. Yeah. Well, it is a crazy story, and I really thank you for calling, and you got to get your word out there. You know, I have a very large audience, so people will know know your story now. They'll know that you were framed. You were, you know, she did you wrong. There's no other way to put it. I'm sorry that that happened to you. I really sorry do. For me. I do. Sorry. And, I mean, is your family over it now, too? Yes, yes, yes. Everything is clear right now because I ever since I spoke with the um blogger so everything is clear okay did you want to take any questions or you're good anyone can ask me questions i'm, I'm on i'll answer let's start i'm glad you're doing this clearing your name no okay guys i'm dropping the link uh just click on the link and uh call in and when you call in you have to click out of youtube yeah. <laughs> i do it again. This is Yolanda's real boyfriend, you guys, not Williams. He's telling us the true story. Now X. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> when, I hope I don't make you uncomfortable when I laugh. I'm just so shocked by what happened to you. And and I but I'm glad that you're telling us what's going on because I'm telling you, everyone here in America had a feeling this story does not make sense and it, it didn't make sense yeah but i'd like to know something I and mean, she real cut it off how much did she make an episode don't you not don't say that you're not allowed to say that he, he just said it he no, was gonna no. tell you okay 1200. oh my god okay you guys said i can't say it hi I did 1200. did you want to ask some questions andrea yeah why did it take you uh, this long to come out and uh, came out earlier. Say, say who? Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Okay. Why did hey my brother? Why did it take you this long to come out and and try to clear your name? Oh, you mean right now? Clear my name right now? Yeah, I don't, yeah. No, I don't, no, 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 no. This is my second time seeing you. No, I cleared my name since. Like, Charlotte, I tried, I told Cheryl about it. He did okay. come out earlier, and he did. Okay. I, yeah, when 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 everything was so we were still hot. Mm -hmm. I, I okay. came out like I came out. I, I spoke you know, to a, I spoke to a blogger in America there. Yeah, She's I also, saw that. She, Yeah, so she also um follows the show. So I went straight to her and I told her everything that happened. Yeah. So that was when I cleared my name. Andrea, yeah. I'm going to take some more call. Okay. And, um, I only can have four on this time because people kept saying they can't hear. Are you going to call okay. in on Thursday, too? Yeah, I love you. Uh, happy Mother's Day. Oh, thank yeah, happy you. Happy Mother's Day, too. And young man, young man, keep yourself safe here yeah? or you're going to be caught up in some shit. <laughs> thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, okay, well. man. Bye. Okay, well, next caller is... Hi. Hi, Norma. Hi, how are you? Happy Good. Mother's Day. 
Thank you so Thank much. You. I really appreciate it. Did you have some questions for Yolanda's ex-boyfriend? Yeah. Um, my question is the following. Can you take your hoodie off for a minute? What? <laughs> Why? There. Yeah. I just wanted to see the shape of his head and everything. Um, I feel for him, you know. Uh, um, thank you, sir, for doing that. But I feel for you. And uh, because our society is so based on the woman gets the bad, uh, uh, you know, the bad part. And, and it's always a man against a woman. And it's really a 50-50 thing, you know. And uh, I'm glad that he showed up. I'm glad that he's talking. And it would be great if he were to talk to her children because they are in a, like in La La Land. I think I look at their faces, compare them to my kids. My kids would have had me in, in a cuckoo house already. Well, listen, they Norma, would, I got more calls because we got a lot of people that want to call in. Thank you for calling in. God bless you. Bye. You. I'm trying to take as many calls as I can. Hi, is it Cashmere? It is. How are you? Good. Did Good you have any questions for Yolanda's ex? You know what? I did. I was going to ask the same question as the last lady. Like, you never had communication with her kids or anything like that? No communications. No communications. Okay. So all this was a scam and she knew. I just find that really amazing. Well, did I you figure something was wrong? It just The story just didn't feel oh. right. It didn't at all. I mean, me and my daughter both watched the show and she was like, Mama, that was you. You know, we were reverse image search a long time ago. So <laughs> <laughs> we didn't know what was going on. But that was my main question. If you ever had a chance to talk to the kids since you only said you knew of three instead of six. Yeah, that's crazy. Listen, thanks for calling in. I'm trying to get as many calls. I don't okay. want to take too much of his time. Thank, Thank you. you. Hi, Bobby. Yes, how you doing? Good. What are your um, questions? Well, I, I, it's more of a comment than a question because, um, first of all, happy Mama's Day. Oh, and and second of all, I'm a big fan of your blog. Oh, and, you. and really, the thing is that really draws a big blank because I'm a big fan of the 90 Day Fiance thing. And it's so hard to... And, and, and I'm not doubting anything, so I'm not going to go there, but it's so weird to me that you're going to, that, that she knew that this person that she was talking to, because this was aired on the show, the man had a Nigerian accent, an African accent. What you're saying is the whole thing felt like a lie? It, it was, it was a big lie. Yeah. And and being a, a, a super fan of the show, it is quite obvious that Yolanda, you know, was catfish. We've already picked that up. Second of all, uh, we all knew that Williams wasn't real. And, 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 and the other thing was is that we knew that there was something fishy about the story, especially the, um, the scene where the daughter and the old and the eldest son was doing a, um, a spit a picture background check mm -hmm. on the guy. Yeah. So, and, listen, uh, Bobby, I gotta speed it up. No, I you get a lot. So, it's a lot. I, it's I, a lot. And I just wanted to say that. And I think you also you want to say you feel bad for him, don't you? Oh yeah, I feel very bad yeah. for him. I, I mean, you know, because Yolanda is not a bad looking woman. She's a very attractive woman. Mm -hmm. But yeah, she uh, is. She yeah, is. I mean, she's a very attractive woman. Even when she was bigger and when she was once married, she's a very attractive woman. And sure. and for her to go through all of that, and for the uh, the brother that went through all that as well, uh, you know, it's it's hard to try and digest that. But mm -hmm. also, I feel that Yolanda is in it for the money. Whatever okay, money she's getting. I, I gotta wrap it up. I don't mean to cut okay. you off. No, no, no. You go right ahead, and um, and I just wanted to say that, and and we'll just keep it moving. Thank but you, Bobby. Have a good day. Okay. One more call, and that's it, because I don't want to take up all his time. Hi, Abby. Hi there, uh, Sherelle. I'm a big fan as well. Just want you to know that. Thank you. Um, I'm just wondering why is Perry not speaking? Because 
he always has a, um, a different point of view and he gets to the root of things. So I am curious. I'm really curious to hear what Terry has to say. Do you believe this guy? And you need to give it to us straight because you always come correct, Perry. What you got to say? <laughs> you know, on, Perry, wrap it up. Hurry up. Let me say this, right? I mean, a lot of stuff goes on. That's why I asked him, when was he dating her, right? And he said, maybe May. And they was talking uh, before that. So he very well could be an ex. I believe but The truth is, for me, I just know that Yolanda, I, from day one, I just felt like she was a scammer. All this other stuff, I knew Williams wasn't real. And then it's hard, it's hard for me to say, I mean, because I really, truly think that they, it's possible that he dated her and that they could have went through this whole thing. Because I don't know, you know Yolanda is just sort of different. You know what I mean? It's like... Uh, Perry, he's on a time schedule. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm sorry. Listen, how do you pronounce your name again? Thank I'm you, Abby, Abby, for calling. Yeah. My name is Uche. Listen, Uche, I'm going to wrap it up because I don't want to take up all your time, and I know you're at work. But I thank you for calling in. I really appreciate it. And um, I'll no problem. reach back out through you to you through um, your DMs, okay? And we'll just, you know. Okay. okay. Thank you so much for calling in. Thank you. Bye. You're welcome. Bye. All right, you take care. Okay, okay now I'm going to take questions from the fans. I'm in the chat room. Go ahead, Perry. What were you saying? Because he's at work. I didn't want to. Oh, yeah, no, I got you. No, no, no. I was just saying that it's, it's really hard to say because mm -hmm. it's hard to say, and then at the same time, it's very irrelevant. It doesn't matter, right? That he was that he was lied to. No, 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 no. I'm saying no, no, no. I, I get that. Mm -hmm. I'm saying as far as the show concerned. He wasn't a major player in the show. Listen, I don't know what you're trying to say, but I'm glad that he came forward. This story felt uh, like fishy to everybody. And now we have a clarity of that. Basically, Yolanda is a social climber trying to become famous. That's what oh, she I did. Get it. Hmm? I get it. Yeah. And you don't do people like that. Right. And definitely. I just, I felt bad for the guy. I could see her lying about having three children, saying she only has three, because she's scared. Mm -hmm. He's probably talking to more guys than we know. No, no I mean, that, now that I do believe, that's why I'm saying that I believe he could be an ex, because I think that she is communicating on these dating sites and things yeah, like that. Yeah, exactly. It's, and that's what I'm saying, but I'm saying, and not to say, I'm saying that it's relevant as far as the show mm -hmm. is, you know, I mean, because we know Williams wasn't real. Mm hmm but William's not coming on here neither. So, I mean, for somebody just to come and say it, I don't see where he would really gain anything from. Yeah, he has no reason to lie. He's not asking for anything. He just wanted mm -hmm. to get a story out there. So I really believe him. Okay, you guys, I got to wrap it up because I didn't even expect to come on. This was just a sudden thing. Um, we will take notes and we'll discuss this on Friday at the block party. Uh, thank you guys for coming in the chat. Thank you for, uh, Coming on at the last minute, Perry. I really appreciate it. Yeah, I was sleeping. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, I get up. You got to hear this story. Yeah. Okay, you guys, thank you. And we will all discuss this in detail at the block party. Thank you guys for calling in. See you later, Perry. Bye-bye. Yeah, Bye. -bye. Bye.